What's up guys, Huso7 here and today I've got a video about the Division PTS or Public Test Server and I'm going to tell you how you can get in it, how you can be playing, what are the dates uh, and what you need to know about it because it seems like there's been some misconfusion on Reddit and on the official forums and uh, you know some of the devs are not replying very quickly so I thought I'd make a video to help you out. So uh, the first question is when does the PTS open? Well if you applied to the Elite Task Force, uh, which is was this, you know, this post that was on the official Ubisoft forums, uh, you know, a couple weeks ago, if you applied for this and specified that you were on PC, you should have gotten emailed to an email account associated with your UPlay account, uh, a, an email code to download and install the game. So if you have it on Steam, you should be able to get it through Steam. If you have it through UPlay, you should be able to get it through UPlay. Uh, but that is right now only open to members of the uh, people who applied for the Elite Task Force. If you you own the game on PC, again, either through Steam or through Uplay, but did not apply for the Elite Task Force, you will be able to play on Monday, September 26th. That's when it goes open to the PC. Now, you might be saying, but who's so 7? What about people on Xbox and PlayStation? Well, I don't have a confirmed answer on this yet. You will not be able to play on the actual Xbox or on the PlayStation because both Microsoft and Sony have a, like a certification process that developers have to go through with their patches, so they will not be able to do a PTS on either of these platforms. However, uh, they did say that it was possible to let people play on the PC to test, but I have not been able, I was asking on Twitter, I was asking on the official Twitch, I just have not got an official answer yet from a developer as to whether or not uh, Xbox and PlayStation players will be able to download the client on the uh, PC and test it. So uh, it might be that on Monday, September 26th, it'll show up in everyone's Uplay library, uh, and so we might be able to get it. I will definitely keep you guys posted, so um, check my Twitter on the 26th. I will let you guys know if that's the case, but as of right now, they have said that it is only open to people who own the game on the uh, a PC version of the game. So if you do own a PC version of the game, Here's what you need to know. You get it, like I said, from Uplay, and you get it from uh, Steam, depending on which platform you own it on. And if you want to see the FAQ, I'll have a link here. You can actually read some frequently asked questions. But uh, basically, this just tells you a little bit about uh, the PTS. If you want to stream on the PTS, you can. It is not under an NDA. You're not under any type of, uh, you know, like like you know, a non-disclosure. You you can share. You can stream. You can talk about it on YouTube. You can do whatever you want. You can talk about it on Reddit. No restrictions there. So be sure to, you know, share your your feedback. Um, you can post on the official forum for the feedback, um, and it, it, that will be open on, on Thursday, September 22nd. So they're giving you some time to play. They're going to give you some time to uh, check it out, and then that will actually, uh, you know, the the forums for the feedback will actually open up a little bit later. So. Um, again, here's where you can check out some of the information. Um, this is talking about this technical test. Um, it specifically says that the technical test will last until September 25th. So um, that's that's how long you'll have to to play at least in this build. So this is like uh, an early an early build. The the PTS is going to go on probably forever. I think they're going to continue to release PTS similar to how like Diablo or World of Warcraft or games like that don't do it where they just test their patches ahead of time. But uh, right now in the PTS it's also worth noting that you have to play with like a cookie cutter character that will be created for you, a fresh level 30. You cannot play with your existing characters. However, uh, they did specifically mention that you will be able to do a character transfer with uh, later versions of the PTS, but for this one right now, you are going to be stuck with the cookie cutter character. So there you have it. Uh, like I said, you can get into the PTS through Uplay and Steam if you own a copy of it uh, on either of those platforms. And if uh, you can get in right now, if you are a member or if you applied, excuse me, not a member, you didn't have to be selected, you just had to apply for the Elite Task Force. So there you have it. I'm going to have some content. If anyone out there is a PC player who does not, who received the code and has no desire to test, please let me know. Send me a Twitter DM. I have my DMs open to anyone or a YouTube message and let me know because I would love to take that code off your hands and get some footage uh, testing the game. So there you have it. Let me know. Uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. Be sure to click that like button if you learned something and subscribe to stay up to date on all of my Division content.